What's going on guys? Welcome back. So Brother Polite, he went live after these allegations. His first, I would say his first live after these allegations came out since Tasha K broke this case. So he went live talking a lot about nothing, which uh, is understandable because he can't really say much because there's an active case going on right now and it's really serious. So it's not much he really can say about the case. That's what he said. In his own words, he said he really want to turn up and say what he want to say and really act out. But he said that will circumvent the aid that his lawyers are trying to uh, render. His attorneys are trying to render. And he said that's plural. So he's telling us that he has a team of lawyers on this now. So so I did watch the live in its entirety. He called it the Rolls Royce Diaries or something like that. It's kind of it's cute. OK, the Rolls Royce Diaries. But he said, like I said, he said, well, I want to say he I want to talk about this. He said people are monetizing his um, name. They're talking about him and they're making money off talking about him because he's so important. Look at you. You're talking about me. You're monetizing your videos. He said, if you hate me so much, why are you monetizing your videos? Because YouTube allow people to monetize. That's why. So I just wanted to answer that question for you brother polite since you posed that question even though it was a rhetorical question and you were trying to be funny or you're trying to be facetious but um youtube allows us to monetize these videos okay and you're saying that th these are just people that hate you no i don't hate you okay let me just say i don't hate you brother polite i follow legal cases over here there's many other channels that follow legal cases. There's um, other lawyers out there. One is Ike Speaks. Ike Speaks. I believe it's I-K-I-E Speaks. Check her out. She's an attorney out of New York. I'm sure she's going to be saying a few things about this case. And I recommend you to watch because she's going to give you a perspective, an attorney's perspective. OK, I'm giving you a layman's perspective layman's perspective she's giving you an attorney perspective she does this for a living so check her out um the rose royce diaries okay brother polite it doesn't even look good you're calling it the rose royce diaries and even speaking because you're not speaking about nothing you're trying to play that you're the victim first of all there's a child involved here there's a mother out there they have a family everybody's watching if i was your attorney i would be like what are you doing OK, even though you didn't say anything about um, the situation at hand. But here's the thing. You're saying that people hate you. This is why they make all these videos. That's not the case. You actually have a case pending right now in the state of Florida. OK, you're a public figure. OK, so people are going to talk about you. There's no different than uh, people talking about other public figures out there i know there's levels to it but you're still a public figure the reason why i say that is because a hand a, a handful of people know who you are and these are the people that's interested right now to see what's going on you were trending on twitter for god's sakes okay but you're saying it's because you've done so much in life you say you've been to so many countries you know this is i'm just telling you the, the paraphrasing the stuff that he said on the live he's been to so many countries he's He's done everything he wanted to do in life. That has nothing to do with the case. All right. We want to talk about the case over here. But since I understand that you can't address it because there's a legal case pending against you and it's serious, you have three serious charges, two are felonies. OK, that can put you away for a great deal of time. OK, so I understand why you can't talk about it. But you're, you're sitting here is putting you in a bad light because you're trying to make yourself out to be the victim. Now, I want to say this. You are innocent until proven guilty. Now, I do know that oftentimes people are found guilty in a court of public opinion. I know that. But I'm going to say that you haven't been convicted of anything. So we're going to say alleged. But like I said, if these stories are true, it's bad, man. It's bad. It really is. It's bad. OK. And um, so I wanted to say that. You said you're, you know, you're outside and you said you got reality TVs in the work coming and you you were talking to somebody. Then you lie. said we getting ready to turn up today and all that stuff. Guys, don't let that fool you. He's nervous. I can see it in his eyes. Don't don't let all that grandiose uh, talk fool you. Uh, he These are serious charges. He's human. 
of course he's nervous okay don't let him sitting in his Rolls Royce doing his Rolls Royce diaries as he calls it as he coins it don't let all of that fool you okay I've been following cases um, talking about vlogging about cases long enough to know that he's in some serious hot water and um, don't let none of that fool you okay don't let none of the money talk fool you he because you know people they like to portray a certain lifestyle um, that they probably not even live in and um, I understand when he said he wants to say more, but he can't. He can't really. And he's right. He, he better get a, a team of lawyers. He better get a team of attorneys to see what they can do for him here. But see, I want to say this. Just because you got a little bit of coin doesn't mean that you're going to be the case. You, you should never have that mentality. Look at Weinstein. Look where he is. He had more money than you. Did he beat his case? No. Found guilty. Um, he's nervous. He he definitely is. And he has a right to be nervous. But like I said, uh, he's being accused right now. He hasn't been convicted. So we're going to see what happens. We're going to follow this case in its entirety. But I wanted to make a video because, you know, since he went live saying a lot about nothing, you know, just bigging himself up, you know, how he is, you know, accomplished all his goals. And it's almost like he's reflecting. If you go look at it, it's almost like he's reflecting like, damn, I could lose it all. That's what I see in his face. I see a man that can lose it all. You know, there's a lot of speculation out there. Um, the, st the stories out there on what happened. Like I said, I can only say alleged, but um, there was enough for them to make a case out of this because you can go right now on the Dade website, Miami Dade website, and find that he's in the system. And um, I know Tasha K said that there will be more charges coming soon. I don't know. I won't know about that until it happens. Um, but I can only go on what that that Miami Dade website has um, has before us. And you can go access that information for free. Now, as far as the story around the forensic evidence, I don't I'm not privy to that. I don't know how true it is, but if it is true, it doesn't look good. Trust me. And, it, it, you know, I think a lot of people are speculating that it is true. If it is, this is almost like a plea case. It's almost like he got to plead out. You don't want to take this to the door because you can't explain you, you. You can't explain why things were found on her garments. You, that's what I'm just, I'm, you know, you got to be careful with these vlogs, too, because the family is watching. There's parties involved here that's watching. So you never know who's watching your video. So I got to be careful. But, you know, you never once mentioned the child. You never once mentioned her. I thought that was telling. I thought that people that you're associated with, they're quickly to victim blame. Uh, I thought that was telling as well. But that's just my opinion. I'm one man with an opinion. Um. Uh, that's what I like to say sometime. But uh, I, I just want to say, don't let the grandiose, uh, you know, talk fool you, you know, because he's a talker. He likes to use words and things like that. And don't let all that fool you. You know, we got to read what's black and white with the courts are printing out and see how this case um, evolves. I do know that he has a uh, court date next month. And uh, we're going to wait and see what happens with that and then see how this case progress. This case could be drawn out. You just never know. But um, I wanted to say that. Um, yeah, he went live and um, this really didn't talk about anything. All you got to do is just put in Brother Polite went live um, dressing allegations and you can actually uh, that video will pull up. But uh, I think most of you that's aware of this right now you already know about that video but he went live on instagram i believe earlier but uh like i said here he has an uphill battle to fight um if the stories are true like i said i keep stressing this i'm hearing different stories but i don't i don't i'm not going to have access to his discovery okay so i'm not going to know all the pertinent details unless this trial goes to court and we're able to see the court proceedings live then we're all going to have a real discussion on this really 
But um, as it stands right now, yeah, it don't look good for him. Don't look good for Mr. Brother Polite. But uh, let me know what you think below. Drop, 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 excuse me, drop a comment, like, share. Also, subscribe. Do me a favor, big favor, and subscribe and hit the bell notification so you can get an update on my latest content as it drops. Until next video, guys. Peace. Peace.